Today's problem is from binomial distribution and this is related to the probability distribution. See here, the problem is the incidence of an occupational disease in an industry is such that the workers have 20% chances of suffering. See here, the chances of suffering is 20%. The incident of an the incidence of an occupational disease in an industry is such that the workers have a 20% chances of suffering from it. What is the probability that out of six workers, see here how many workers? Out of six workers chosen at random, four or more will suffer from the disease. So the question is very clear here. The incidence of an occupational disease in an industry is such that the workers have a 20% chance of suffering from it. What is the probability that out of 6 workers chosen at random, 4 or more will suffer from disease? See, first one, we have to select P. P is nothing but the probability of a worker suffering from the disease. So, what is the probability that a worker suffer from the disease is 20% chance. See here, this is 20%. Therefore, P is equal to 20 by 100, which is equal to, that is... 0 0.2 and the probability that the no worker suffering from the disease is see the total probability as you know that is p plus q is equal to 1 p is equal to 0 0.2 so this is 0 0.2 plus q is equal to 1 so q is equal to 1 minus 0 0.2 q value is equal to this is 0 0.8 see we got the value of q as a 0 0.8 and p value as see here this is 0 0.2 so we got the value of p as well as q see 20 percent of chance of suffering from it so 20 percent is the is the value of uh, p p is equal to 20 percent and p is equal to 20 by 20 by 100 which is equal to 0 0.2 and clearly p plus q is equal to 1 the total probability is unity and therefore q value is equal to 0 0.8 so we got the value of p as 0 0.2 q as 0 0.8 now from the question see what is it we have to find out what is the probability that six workers out of six workers so here n is equal to six Chosen at random, four or more, four or more will suffer from the disease. So, four or more, more means greater than four. So, the, that is the probability that that four or more, four or more workers will suffer from the disease will suffer from disease is probability of x greater than or equal to 4 so total there are six chances therefore probability of x greater than or equal to 4 which implies probability of x is equal to 4 plus probability of x is equal to 5 plus probability of x is equal to 6. So, maximum there are 6 chances. Therefore, we have a formula that probability of uh, x is equal to r is equal to this is n c r p power r and this is q power this is n minus r. So, we have to substitute all the values here. So, what is our p value? So, p is very clear as 0 0.2. So, p value is 0 0.2, q value is uh, 0 0.8, this is 0 0.8, n is equal to 6. And accordingly, r value is 4 here, 5 here and 6 here. So, now I am going to calculate. So, if I calculate, see what will be the answer. This will be probability of x greater than or equal to 4 is nothing but n c r. What is n value? n is equal to 6. n c r is 4 here ncr this is p power r and this is q power n minus r first one next for r is equal to 5 this is ncr p power r and this is q power n minus r and next one for this last one x is equal to 6 that is nc6 
p power r and next q power that is 0 0.8 power n minus r. Now we have to calculate this value. So 6 c 4 is nothing but 6 backward steps. Sorry 4 backward steps that is 6 into 5 into this is 4 into 3 divided by 4 front steps that is 1 into 2 into 3 into 4. This is 0 0.2 power 4 and this is 0 0.8 6 minus 4 square. So this is 6 c 5, 5 backward steps that is 5, 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 by this is 1 into 2 into 3 into 4 into 5. And this value is 0 0.2 power 5 into this is 0 0.8 power 1. And the next one 6 C1 as you know th this value is 1. This is 0 0.2 power 6 and this is 0 0.8 power 0. Anything to the power of uh, 0 is uh, again 1. So if I cancel the, these values. So this goes in 3 times. So this is 2. This is 3. This is 4 and this value is 5. So, this is 3, 5 is a 15. The value here is 15 into 0 0.2 power 4 and this is 0 0.8 square. And see here, the value here, what is left over? 6 times of 0 0.2 power 5 and this is 0 0.8 plus, see here, this is 1 into, this value is 0. Uh, 2 power 6 and this is also equal to 1. The least value minimum value is 0 0.2 power 4. So if I take this, this will be 15 into 0 0.8 square plus 6 into this value is a 0 0.2. This is 0 0.2 into 0 0.8 plus this is 0 0.2 square. So this value will be 0 0.2 power 4 and see the value here will be 15 into so this is 15 into 0 0.8 square the value here is 9.6 so this value is 9.6 plus the next one here is 6 into 0 0.2 into this is 0 0.8 the value here is 0 0.96 plus again 0 0.2 square the value here is 0. Uh, 0 0.2 into 0 0.2. See here, 0 0.2 into 0 0.2. The value here is 0 0.04. 0 0.04. Now, if I add up all these values, see here, so this value is uh, 0 0.2 power 4. And this value will be, this will be 9.6 plus 0 0.96 plus this is 0 0.04. Here the value is 10.6 uh, into 0 0.4 power 4. 0 0.2 power 4. So this is nothing but uh, 0 0.01696. Therefore, the probability of uh, getting 4 or more. The probability of getting. See here. So what is asked in the question? What is the probability that out of 6 workers chosen at random, 4 or more will suffer from the disease? So, the probability that 4 or more will suffer from the disease is 0 0.1696. See, this is also so simple. First of all, what is given? There is 20% chance of suffering from the disease. So, therefore, P is equal to 20% and Q will be automatically 0 0.8, 80%. 80% if P and Q are given and from the question out of 6 workers total workers are 6 N is equal to 6 4 or more 4 or more is pr uh, probability of X greater than or equal to 4 so maximum N value is equal to 6 so 4 5 6 so after substituting all the values and finally I got the answer as a 0 0.01696 and this is how we have to solve thank you so much for watching and stay until the end